A shaft is loaded in bending and torsion such that the moment varies from minus 15 newton meters to 135 newton meters and the torque varies from minus 10 to 80 newton meters. For a shaft with an ultimate strength of 700 megapascals and a true fracture strength of 1045 megapascals, a fully corrected endurance limit of 210 megapascals, and fatigue stress concentration factors of 2.2 and 1.8 for KF and KFS respectively, what is the factor of safety following the DE Moro criterion if the diameter of the shaft is 26.68 millimeters? This is the third example for the shaft design main video. Links to that video and examples 1 and 2 are in the description of this video. The factor of safety for the DE Moro criterion will depend on the endurance limit, the true fracture strength, and the A and B coefficients we developed during the main video. We would usually start by calculating the endurance limit using the marine factors like we studied in a previous video, link below, but in this case we're given a fully corrected value for the endurance limit. For this reason, this problem comes down to calculating the capital A and capital B coefficients. For that, we need to first calculate the alternating moment and torque and the mean moment and torque. With these values and the fatigue stress concentration factors, we can calculate the values for A and B. Remember that the fatigue stress concentration factors will depend on the notch sensitivity factors Q and the static stress concentration factors KT and KTS. Links to examples of that process are in the description below. With the values of A and B, we can now calculate the factor of safety. Thanks for watching.